Signal Jenga from the African Mines of Bari Park in Ontario. Drives all the tall plans, animals they can't get up to 20 feet tall. Across from the giraffe enclosure, we do have our two spur tortoises named Boris and Optimus, so they can get up to 100 pounds. Over to the right, we have three African lions, one male, two females. Our male's name is Boomer, and our females are Mally and Callie. Mally and Callie were born here at the Greater Vancouver Zoo, and we got Boomer from the Granby Zoo in Quebec. In the wild, the females will do the hunting, and the males will protect their territory from other rival males. That is why they have that big mane around their head. It's to protect them when they get to fight. Behind the lion's enclosure, you can find the two jaguars, named Loki and Jasper. Next enclosure on the right is our beautiful Siberian tiger, Hannah. Hannah was born May 22nd, 2011, making her 10 years old. We got Hannah from the Seoul Zoo in South Korea. Siberian tigers are one of the biggest cats in the world. Females can get up to 400 pounds, while the males can get up to 700 pounds. These by Siberian tigers in Russia, Korea, and the Himalayan regions. Behind the Siberian tigers enclosure, you can find the two cougars, Rosie and Rocket. On the right, we have our two Vietnamese, Fog Belly Pig. Their names are Portly and Daisy, and we got them from the Calgary Zoo. You'll find them in the middle of the enclosure, just in front of the lot. On the right, we have our 21 pink flamingos. One thing you may not know about flamingos is they are not naturally pink. They are born in a dull gray color and acquire that pink from eating large amounts of a pink that called beta carotene, which is found in their diet. If you look closely at the flamingo's legs, in the middle is a ball joint, that is their ankle, and further up under the bridge is their knee. about to enter the train tunnel, so make sure your arms and legs and belongings are inside those carts, and I'll see you on the way out. To the left, we have our two male bear canal. Male antlers are the fastest growing bones. They grow one inch per day, can weigh around 40 pounds, and be about four feet long. They can also twist their ears backwards in this pretty wrestling. Behind their enclosure, there's a nice North American trail where you can find some more North American animals, as well as Conservation Corner, where we have our breeding yeah. programs with the Oregon Spotted Frog, Taylor Tucker's Wild Butterfly, and the Western Bay Turtle.
Dia overboard. Mexico's on the right is our hippos. We have a male named Haven and a female named Hazina. We got Haven and Hazina from the Grand Museum of Quebec, and both of our hippos weigh just a bit over 4,000 pounds, although the average male hippo can get up to 7,000 pounds. You'll find one of our hippos in the water right now. Uh, I know they look like oh, the African one. water potatoes, oh, but I'm sure yeah. they are not. They are yeah, one huh? of the most dangerous animals in Africa. They can get up to 30 kilometers an hour on land and be as fast as a motorboat in the water. That being said, a boat is actually swift. It is a locomotion called hunting. It's like us being just deep in the water running ashore. Coming up on the left, if you guys look down, we've got our reindeer, also known as caribou. We have six reindeer, we have four females, and two oh, males. Reindeers are the only species of deer, both males and the females with antlers. From the three grizzly cubs, it's the three black bears, Thai, yeah. Basil, and Rosemary. And across from there, it closes, yeah, is the grizzly oh, bear oh, shadow. Oh, Alright, everyone, I'm just about to go over the train tracks, yeah, so make sure you don't lean over too far, it can be a long way down.
pandas on the right coming up is the red pandas. We have a male named Abru and a female named Sakura. Despite the name of those two guys are not related to the giant panda, they have their own family group. We're more closely related to some and Rackets. Closer on the right is the camel. We have three of them. We have two dromedary camels. So the ones with the one home, we have one factory camel. She has two of them. We have Nimit, Gemma, and April. Next enclosure on my left is the Sika Deer and the Fair Demon Deer. Sika Deer are the ones with the spots on their bodies that don't be excellent so they're to escape predators. The Fair Demon Deer is considered extinct in the wild due to populations being overhunted to extinction, although some of them still remain on some reserves. Right, we have the Scimitar Horned Oryx. This species is extinct to the wild to rely on breeding programs and zoos such as our beauty survival program. The oryx can also raise their body temperatures up to 47 Celsius. Wow. And over to our left, we have our ADAX. ADAX is a found in Central Africa. They are the antelope best to death to their life in the desert. We have our Zebu cattle, his name is Zeus. He gives us hopes of our backs, it's similar to camels. Yeah. Yeah. Over to the left of the back bag, we'll see there is our Zebu Sahar. Those two zebras have the same striping pattern, so it's like us with our bigger brain.